Hello, I am Ian and I am a teacher by profession. I have been with Native Camp for a month now. I made this blog to help newbies like me who are still adjusting on how to conduct classes in Native Camp. So I will be showing one of my classes wherein I was teaching grammar beginner course. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Can you hear me and see me well? Ah, uh, yes. Alright, that's nice. By the way, my name is Ian. What's your name? Yeah, my name is Mizuki. Mizuki, is this the correct spelling? Ah, yes, that's right. Nice to meet you there, Mizuki. Nice to meet you, yeah. Alright, can I ask if I am speaking too fast, too slow, or just okay? Ah, uh, just okay. Alright, that's nice. Thank you so much. So now let's proceed to the text you chose, okay? Alright, today's lesson is Grammar Beginner 13. The title is Review on Lessons 6 to 12. Please repeat after me. Review on Lessons 6 to 12. Review on Lessons 6 to, 6 to 12. Alright, now kindly check today's goal. I'm done. Very good. Now let's move on to new words and expressions. Kindly repeat after me twice. Okay. Each other. Each other. Each other. Each other. They see each other every day. 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 Personal problem. Personal problem. Personal problem. Personal problem. They talk about personal problems. They talk about personal problems. Spend. 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 Emily often spends time with Lila's family. 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 Weekday. 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 Layla usually stays at her apartment on weekdays. Layla usually stays at, at her apartment on weekends. Layla usually stays at her apartment on weekdays. Layla usually stays at her apartment on weekdays. Different. 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 Emily's family lives in a different state. 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 The same way. Same way. The same way. Same way. Layla's feel the same way about Emily. Layla feels the same way about Emily. Layla feels the same way about Emily. Rayla feels the same way about Emily. Live. 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 They both live in the same city. 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 Same. 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 They go to the same school. 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 Doctoral candidate. Doctoral candidate. Doctoral candidate. Doctoral candidate. They are doctoral candidates. They are doctoral candidates. They are doctoral candidates. They are doctoral candidates. Doctor. 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 Emily works for Doctor Green. Emily works for Dr. Green. Emily works for Dr. Green. Emily works for Dr. Green. Stay. 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 Layla usually stays at home. 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 Visit. 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 They often visit her family on weekends. They often visit her family on weekends. They often visit her family on weekends. 
Zai Okom with her family on weekend. Welcome. 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 Leila's family always welcomes her. 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 Very good. So now we're done with the uh, new words and expressions there. So do you have any questions before we proceed to the next part? Oh, no, so far. Thank Very you. good. So now let's move on to short story. Please check the directions first. Okay, I'm done. All right. So uh, what's your choice here? Do you need to have a uh, switching of parts here? I'll read the first part and you'll read the second part or you're going to read the whole paragraph. Uh, so, sorry. Uh, uh, what do you, what's your choice? You read the whole paragraph or we'll go I'm going to read the first paragraph and you're going to read the paragraph. What's your what's your choice there? Uh, oh. Uh, f first paragraph. Okay, so you will read the first paragraph and I will read the second paragraph. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, can we start? Oh, Leila and Emily are best friends. They both live, they both live in the same city and they go to the same school. They are doctoral candidates. Leila works for Dr. Brown and Emily works for Dr. Green in their Laborat laboratories. They see each other every day and they often study together too. Because they see each other every day, they talk about many things, work, their dreams, friends, family and even their personal problems. Wow, very good. So there's no such mispronounced words there. Alright, yeah. good. So I'll read the second paragraph here. So kindly listen carefully, okay? Okay. Today, they are spending time at Layla's parents' house. Layla usually stays at her apartment on weekdays and often visits her family on weekends. Layla's family knows Emily, and they like her very much. Emily sees her family only twice a year because they live in a different state. Emily often spends time with Layla's family. Emily never feels lonely because Layla's family always welcomes her. Emily thinks she is so lucky to have a friend like Layla and Layla feels the same way about Emily. Alright, good job. So now this time, let's read the short story again. So please repeat after me. Okay, let's do it sentence per sentence. Okay. Alright, let's start. Layla and Emily are best friends. Leila and Emily are best friends. They both live in the same city and they go to the same school. They both live in the same city. They go to the same school. They are doctoral candidates. They are doctoral candidates. Leila works for Dr. Brown and Emily works for Dr. Green in their laboratories. Oh, Leila works for Dr. Brown and Emily works for Dr. Green in their laboratories. They see each other every day and often study together too. They, they see each other every day and they often study together too. Because they see each other every day, they talk about many things, work, their dreams, friends, family, and even their personal problems. Because they see each other every day, they talk about many things, work, their dreams, friends, family, and even their personal problems. Today, they are spending time at Leila's parents' house. Today, they are spending time at Leila's parents' house. Leila usually stays at her apartment on weekdays and often visits her family on weekends. Leila usually stays at her apartment on weekdays and often visits her family on weekends. Leila's family knows Emily and they like very much. They like her very much. Leila's family knows Emily and they like her very much. Emily sees her family only twice a year because they live in a different state. Emily sees her family only twice a year 
because they live in a different states. Emily often spends time with Layla's family. Emily often spends time with Layla's family. Emily never feels lonely because Layla's family always welcomes her. Oh, Emily never feels lonely because Layla's family always welcomes her. Emily thinks she is so lucky to have a friend like Layla, and Layla feels the same way about Emily. Emily thinks she is so lucky to have a friend like Layla, and Layla feels the same way about Emily. Alright, good job in reading the parts there. So this time, let's move on to questions. Okay. okay. Please check the directions first. I'm done. Alright, now Mizuki, kindly answer my questions. Number one, who does Leila work for? Oh, she works for Dr. Brown. Very good. How often do Leila and Emily see each other? Oh, they see each other every day. Good job. Next, what do Leila and Emily talk about? Oh, they talk about uh, friends, uh, family, and uh, personal problems. Very good. So they talk many things, right? Their dreams, work, friends, family, and even their personal problems. Good job. You have a better com comprehension there. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Next, we still have questions number four. Uh, four, five, six, and seven to ten. Okay, where okay. does Layla stay on weekdays? Uh, she she usually stays at uh, Layla's apartment on weekdays. Good. What does Layla visit her family when? Uh, so sorry. Does Layla visit her family when? W when? Yes. Uh, we. Uh, uh, we weekends. Uh, she visits uh, week weekends. All right, very good. She visits them on weekends. Does Layla's family know Emily? Do they like her? Oh yes. Uh, they know Emily. Uh, they like her. Very good. Yes, they do. They like her very much. Where very does? Much, yeah. <laughs> Where does Emily's family live? Uh, Emily's family live in uh, different states. Very good. In a different state? In, in, a, in a different state. Very oh. good. How often does Emily see her family? Uh, Emily see her family uh, twice a year. Alright, good. Does Emily feel lonely? Why or why not? Oh no, uh, because uh, Leila's family always welcomes uh, her. Good job. Next, we have your last question. How does Leila feel about Emily? Oh, sorry. Uh, how does Leila feel about Emily? Yes. Like, uh, what's what's her feeling towards Emily? Uh, she she thinks. Uh, she feels. She feels, uh, she feels lucky to have a friend like uh, Emily. Very good. She feels lucky that she has a friend like Emily. Alright, Tote Moyoi in answering the, <laughs> in the, que the questions here. So let's proceed now to the exercise, okay? Okay. Alright, so kindly read first the directions. I'm wrong. Alright, now please make questions, okay? First, let's read the example. Please read the you part. Okay. When do they usually go to the gym? They usually go to the gym in the evening. Uh, how much do they pay for the gym monthly? They pay $50 monthly. Alright, great. Now let's start with number one. Are you ready? Okay. Alright, please start. Uh, when when does he usually go to the supermarket? Very good. He usually goes to the supermarket after work. Uh, how much how much does does he spend on food monthly? Very good. He spends three hundred dollars monthly. Next number two. Oh, uh, 
Uh, when does she? Uh, when does he go to the hotel? Very good. How he goes to the hotel every Monday. Uh, how much does he pay for one night? This is his hotel. He never pays for anything. Uh, when when do they uh, when do they usually go to the bar? Very good. They go to the bar every weekend. Uh, how much uh, how much do they pay for drink? Monthly. How much do they pay on drinks? On on drinks. Okay. How much do they pay on drinks? How much do they pay on drinks? I don't know how much, but they spend a lot of money on drinks. Alright, so let's move on to the next exercise. Please check the directions. I'm there. Okay, so now let's do the exercise. Example here, he often blank beer. So the word, the verb there inside the parenthesis is drinks. So the answer, he often drinks beer. Okay, let's start okay. number one. Oh, the store opens at 9 a.m. and closes at 7 p.m. One more time, please. The, the store opens at 9 a.m. and the clothes at 7 p.m. Closes. C closes. Yeah. Closes. Closes. And not sees, but se says. Closes. Closes. Says. Says. Very good. Closes. Closes. Good. So it's actually the answer here is closes, not close. Okay, because the okay. store is singular, so the verb must be in a plural form with S. Oh, okay? okay, the uh, S form of the verb. So the store opens at 9 a.m. and closes at 7 p.m. All right, is it clear? Oh, all right. Okay, good. Okay. Next, you have number two. O Olivia is in the kitchen. She blank breakfast. Make. Olivia is in the kitchen. She is making breakfast. Very good. The sentence is in present continuous form. Very good. Next, we have number three. He never blank meat. He is a vegetarian. He never eats meat. He is a vegetarian. Good job. Next, they usually blank TV after dinner, but today they blank books. Watch and read. They usually watch, they usually watch TV after dinner, but today they are reading books. Very good. That's correct. There, a combination of a uh, simple present and present continuous. Next, we have number five. Look at the cat. It blank on your bed again. Sleep. Look at the cat. It it is sleeping on your bed again. Wow! Good job. Next, we have here, Ryan is busy today. He blank in the garage. Clean. Ryan is busy today. He is cleaning in the garage. Wow! Toti <laughs> moyoy! Congratulations in finishing the exercises here. And you provided correct answers. Oh, thank you. Alright, so you now mastered the sentence constructions in simple present and present continuous forms. Good. Okay. Now this time, let's proceed to the free conversation. Please check the directions first. Okay, I'm done. Alright, so let's start. But before that, let's read first the words inside the word bank. Okay, so kindly repeat after me. Wake up. Wake up. Eat breakfast. Eat breakfast. Change clothes. Change clothes. Read books. Read books. Eat lunch. Eat lunch. Go to work or school. Go to work or school. Study. Study. Talk. Talk. Drink. Drink. Run. 
lang. Take a bath. Take a bath. Brush one's teeth. Brush one's teeth. Sleep. Sleep. Go to bed. Go to bed. All right. So, uh, Mizuki, we're going to use the words inside the word bank. Okay. So use them as much as possible if you want. Okay. All right, so let's start. Number one, tell me about your daily life. Uh, I wake up uh, in the morning and eat breakfast. I wake and... up. Maybe we can make uh, wake up and eat breakfast in one uh, in one format. Okay, in one sentence construction. I wake okay. up and and eat breakfast in the morning okay oh okay in the morning all right good what else yes uh after eat breakfast uh, i pre i prepare i prepare to go to uh, office office okay so and you will say i am preparing after I am preparing, uh, I am preparing after breakfast. Okay. I am preparing after breakfast. All right. So after okay. breakfast, you are going to prepare for your work. No. Uh, yes. All yes, right. Yes. Uh, I start. I start to work on nine a.m. and finish. To work uh, 7 p.m. Okay, you will say I start working at 9 a.m. Yeah. and finish working at 7 p.m. Okay, good job. But before we continue to question number two here, let's have first the uh, uh, review of the words and phrases that we learned today. Okay, first we learned. Uh, yes. Uh, number. Uh, before we proceed to number two, we will read first and say first the words that we learned and phrases that we learned today. Uh, okay. okay. So first we learned the following words here: spend. 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 One more time. Spend. Spend. Next we have here weekday. 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 Very good. We also have different. 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 One more time. Different. Different. Very good. We mispronounced this word earlier. Classes. Crosses. Oh, cl eh, se says classes. Classes. Very good. One more time. Classes. Classes. Last time, please. Classes. Classes. Very good. So we also learn this phrase here, the same way. The same way. The same way. Same way. One last time. The same way. The same way. All right. Good job. So let's proceed now, and let's go back again to question number two. Tell me about your family member's daily life. Example, your father, your mother, sister, or your brother. Ah, okay. Uh, my mother uh, wake up and uh, make, make breakfast and uh, eat breakfast in the morning. My mother wakes up and makes... Wakes up and makes breakfast in the morning okay in the morning so since okay. mother is singular again the verb will be in s form okay my mother okay. wakes up and makes breakfast in the morning what else oh uh, and uh, my mother uh, cleans at 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 home all right my mother cleans the house the house yeah. all right my mother cleans the house what house. about your father uh, father yes 
Oh, my father uh, wakes up and uh, he eats breakfast in the morning. Okay, my father wakes up and eats breakfast. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> in the morning, okay. Oh, uh, uh, he eats. He is preparing, pre preparing uh, after breakfast. Okay, after breakfast, we will say after breakfast, he is preparing for work. For what? Okay. Yeah. Okay, you will say after breakfast first. All uh, right. First. After okay. breakfast, he is preparing for work. Oh, okay, I got it. Uh, can you read one more time? After. After breakfast, he is preparing for work. Alright, good job, Mizuki, in this lesson. Okay, unfortunately, we don't have much time left. I would commend your vocabulary skills in this lesson. You were able to use these words in sentence construction. Oh, okay, so good job, and see you again in Native Camp. Bye-bye, okay. matane. So there you go. So that's actually one of the actual classes I had in, my, in Native Camp. So every after lesson you make sure that you need to give students a message indicating the words phrases that they learn during the lesson and also the mispronounce and grammar mistakes that they have and don't forget to give an evaluation after that okay <laughs>